if you are running an AI agency with N8 and agents, you know AI agents are great at handling most of the queries. But what happens when your clients, customers need that human touch? In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to add live chat capabilities to your N8 and agents in just five minutes. No coding required. Let me break this down into three simple steps. First, head over to chatdash.com and create your agency account. For those who don't know already about Chatdash, Chatdash is a wide label client dashboard platform for AI agents. Basically, you can bring your N8 and AI agents and present complete wide label dashboards to your clients. For details, I have put the link in the description of another video just covering how the dashboard works for N8 and AI agents. While you can start with the pro plan trial, you will need to upgrade to premium plan for live chat features. But well, don't worry, there's a 30 day one back guarantee, so there's zero risk. Once you're in, click on the client step and add your first client. Just fill in their name, login ID, and password. Super simple. So I'll click on new client and let me give my client name N8N client. Login ID is going to be N8N client. Password is going to be whatever the password you want. And the language is going to be English. And create client. So you just create an N8 and client in the client tab. Now here's where the magic happens. Go to the chatbot tab and click add chatbot and select N8N from the options. And you need a chatbot name, N8N support bot. For N8N chat web URL, you will find this in the chat trigger node of your N8N workflow. So you want to go to, so here's my N8N account and I created this demo AI agent for this video. And let me go into there. And if I click this trigger node, I can get the chat URL here. And all you need to do is basically copy this chat URL and paste it into chat dash. So now you have created a client and their chatbot. Go back to clients and click project assign. And you will see the N8 and agent we just added. Click assign. And this is the game changing part. Head over to project settings, click these three dots and go to project settings and, and go to settings. And you want to turn this live agent on and click save. So this allows your clients to jump in whenever they need to take over from the AI. Your clients can now see live chat requests in their dashboard and take over conversations with a single click. And let me show you how this works in the real time. So to test this out, I would go to prototype page here for testing and just imagine this bot is embedded in, embedded on your customer's website and what i want to do is basically go back to clients and get the client login id and password so it was an aiden client and the password that i said i'm going to log out from an agency account and log in as a client here yep so now you have logged in as a client there's no data at all for now but what you want to do as a client is basically turn this status button on. And as you can see in here, this button will appear on the chat widget. This basically means that at least one of the human agents are available to support this chat bot. Let me start off chatting with AI. So hello. And so this response is from AI. And let's say I want to talk to human, right? And if I click this chat button, your, your client will get the notifications here saying that the live agent is requested for this chatbot. What your client can do is go to conversations and they will see this new conversation appeared on the, on the client dashboard. And what I want to do as an agent is basically click this continue chat yourself to interrupt the AI conversation. And I can basically have a conversation with my client. I, I can start having a conversation with the chat user. Hey, this is human. And the website visual will see this exact response from myself, the agent. And once you resolve the issue that you can handle, we can pass this chat to AI with this uh, clickable button. The website visitor can uh, start chatting with AI normally. So yeah, this is, this is a response from an and AI agent. And that was one way to start a conversation with human agent and, and the website visitor. The other way is basically instead of getting, getting users to click this button, let's say your, your client is on this dashboard and 
and the AI is kind of struggling to answer users' questions. Let's say like if the user says like this, even if they don't click this chat button, you can basically or your client can basically interrupt the conversations by just clicking this button, continue chat yourself. And from there, you can basically interrupt the conversation of the AI agent and start helping the user out. Here's your human agent, how can I help? So yeah, so the, the conversation is taken over to a human agent. And now this user can continue the conversation with the human agent. Oh, this is human things. And basically, you know, your client can continue to have a conversation with website visitor. And there you have it, live chat capabilities added to your N8 and agent in just five minutes without any coding skills. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more AI agency tips and I'll see you in the next video.